Vani Tripathi, you, 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 I, I can prove it to you in a second if you listen to me. I think I'll prove it to you in a second. I'll tell you, I'll give you an example, Vani. Who I respect so much like you. You don't have to respect me. You are insinuating or not? No, I'm not insinuating. I'm saying it. not correct. No, I'm saying it. I'm not even insinuating. I'm saying it. What will you do? When you say conspiracy, prove who's behind Okay, so then if you complete your point, you see, problem is this is not the parliament of India where you can go on non-stop and somebody else walks out. BJP, RSS, what does this mean? Okay, what's it? Relax. Don't get touchy about RSS. I didn't even mention RSS. You're already hypersensitive about RSS. This is stroking gestures. No, no, now, one second, please. You know, if the BJP spokespersons want to please the RSS by defending them when I didn't even mention mention them well your point has been made i'm sure that jhandewala has seen you may defend them now no, one I'm second vani please hold off the for a moment no, yogesh you, master is a live living please. example I one second saying, one second please. vani have the patience to who listen please miss tripathi listen to me miss tripathi please stop and listen to me miss please listen to me miss tripathi i don't want to go on about this now okay one second i'm making a point here you know what happens i'll tell you what happens just one second yogesh i'm coming to you it's your case i'm talking about one side creates the trouble. So there are these, you know, these gundas, what are their names? Muthalek, Futalek, he almost tried to join the BJP, didn't he? All these groups, they operate, they build the pressure, they have some 50, 60 goons, they must be paying them 50, 100 rupees each, go break a shop, create some tamasha, right? And then, on the other side, other people go and they say, oh, you know what, the, if this book continues, or this film is released, it's a threat to public order. We are totally for free speech. People like Vani Tripathi are totally for free speech. But what to do? There will be public disorder, there will be a riot, and let me give you an example of what happened. The person on the right-hand side of the screen, Vani Tripathi, his name is Yogesh Master. He wrote a book. His book is called Dhundi, the story of a forester becoming Ganapati. Accordingly, Hindu fringe groups say it portrays the relationship of, of Shiva, Parvati, Ganesh in a highly objectionable manner. You know what happened to Yogesh Master? He can tell you. There were all these fringe group protests and then he was arrested on October, August 29th, I think 2013. He was charged under 295 and 298 of the Indian Penal Court. And who filed the charge against him? Pramod Muthalik and others. He was arrested for making comments on Lord Ganesha. He actually was arrested at that point of time. So he can tell you, you know, this is very convenient. I am for free speech, but problem is that, you know, these groups will run riot if this continues anymore. And we see through it, Vani. We see through it. We see through it. The symbiotic relationship here. We see through it. Yogesh Master, were you arrested? What would you like to say? Yogesh Master. Yogesh Master, please. How many people will you? No, Vani, let Yogesh Master speak, please. No, let Yogesh Master speak. Yogesh Master. Define Arre, please let me hear somebody else, Yogesh Master. Yogesh Master, please. Vani, please. Yogesh Master. Hello. Hello. Ah, uh, Ms. Vani ji, first of all, here, when we have written something, it is certainly it is not baseless. It is. It has certainly its own uh, research and our way of projecting the things and looking at the things. When we have the freedom of expressing this, and also you have the freedom of rejecting it also, but you cannot curb our uh, entire uh, thing. Exactly. The of expression, whatever you call it, and and. Uh, why can't you have that much little sense you simply neglect and give it away don't look at it at all there are a lot of things that nothing is forcing you to uh, uh, accept this but you people have kind of uh, fear or scared or you are making political uh, some kind of uh, coming forward to make your things done this is what it is happening uh, that to having the uh, religious absolutely uh, and, and 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 you know you know how, you know how it hurts because mr inayatullah is there in chennai once mr inayatullah was at the lead of the protest against the film vishwarupam i had many debates with him today you know the irony monica one minute no one second violating any provision of law or not don't teach the law and don't teach the law, the freedom of expression, no, why not the freedom of expression. Nobody can go to the court. You don't want to learn the freedom law. Freedom of expression. But this country is court. governed by rule don't of law. Don't tell me going to if court is blasphemy. If any provision of In law. In my view, going to court is blasphemy. blasphemy. And any regards for their religion. everybody has the right to approach the court. No, no. Listen. What do you mean is not having any regard for law? We are going don't to the court. Don't damn the courts. Don't damn the protesters. Damn everybody who speaks like that. Monica. Monica, the facts of the Monica, you know the, your fringe, you know this fringe. 
cringe which you represent hey, Arna, you are perpetually I, I, angry with I one thing or the right other to, if we let I the running of the right country go to you your policies you see this, i don't have a right to abuse you no no right monica Mo monica monica right monica i want to point you you are a lawyer i don't want to actually i don't want to teach you the law I don't want to teach you the law, but you must understand this and have listened to me. The freedom of expression protects, and I quote, not merely the ideas that are accepted, but those that offend. Ideas that offend. Ideas that shock. Ideas that disturb the state or any sector of the population. Such are the demands of pluralism, tolerance, broad-mindedness, about which there is, without which there is no democratic society. I, this is the celebrated judgment, S. Rangarajan versus P. Jagjivan Ram in the Supreme Court that I'm quoting from. You don't know this. You don't know this. As half man, half woman. Are by the all the day. Are the is not invented by anyone. You don't even know. You don't even know your religion. You are so ignorant. Have you told is everybody what is there in the book? was invented by, by the author. Scholarly it's been there, in a, it's been there on a temple written? walls. So, so what, what are we talking are about? Mr. Inayatullah. You need to do your research a little more. Mr. Inayatullah, will you... Would you that maybe they have a genuine grievance. Mr. Miss Monica, one minute. Miss, Miss Inay Mr. Inayatullah, yeah, while you were outraged by the portrayal of Muslims in the film Vishwarupam, I want to point, you, point out to you the dangers of what you have done today. There is no day difference between you and these fringe groups. There is no difference between you, these fringe groups, or those people who attacked physically Taslima Nasri, threatened, stifled her presence in this country, and she was even questioned. Or for that matter, between supporters of the All India MIM who had done that at that time. You're all together right now. At some point, Mr. Inayatullah, the upsurge is now beginning to build up on the other side. Many people are tired of you, want to move on, want to isolate you. Want to expose you? Sorry, Mr. Arnab. Want to Arnab, question you, Mr. Inayatullah? I'm sorry to say that. Yes. Please. <coughs> no, 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 Mr. Arnab, you have, mis mis you have misconceived. No, you have misconceived. What? I want to object to the uh, statement of Mr. M R V. Also, he compared the Vishwarupam as well as this book. In no way it is comparable. Vish Vishwarupam was something different. No, that it's the is same issue. Them. It's the they same issue. Whether it is Vishwarupam or this, or whether it is the film it is. Fire in where 1996, which no, had explicitly no, no, depicted homosexual relations, no, no. or whether it is Black it. Friday, or whether it is the no, film no. Water, which represented no. the depiction of widows in rural India, misogyny and ostracism. They are all the no. same. I'm sorry if you're offended. It's your problem. It's The issue is the same, Mr. Inayatullah. No, Arnab. Arnab, I'm sorry. Anyway, no, MR can no. respond to you. No, I'm sorry. Mr. Arnab, no, it's, it's Arnab, not the thing. It's not when the it thing. comes to in, Muslim in and minority things, groups, in, in the Mr. government Mr. has always banned. Things, but when it comes to the majority, it is now culture. that it is seen that, that the government that doesn't interfere. This is the That's first time that the government has interfered in Tamil Nadu. I've seen that the death of a particular author. So this is something very new. If you don't want it, you don't want it. Whereas in that picture, the enmity, the enmity among the Muslims and Hindus were very much there. Mr. Inayatullah, Mr. Inayatullah, you are, you are, Mr. Inayatullah, you are... There is no Hindus in Afghanistan where the movie was shot. No, 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 no. Mr. Inayatullah, Mr. Inayatullah, if you had seen the movie, anyway, I think people like you, Monica, all the fringe, etc. I think, I'm sorry to say this, especially for those people who say this is, you know, insulting the Hindu religion. You don't know your religion. I'm asking Indira Tiwari here. I'm asking Indira Tiwari. Indira Tiwari, tell me. No, no, Indira Tiwari and Aryaman Sundaram. Suppose I say, Miss Monica, Miss Monica, please. Miss Monica, Miss Monica. Miss Monica, please understand this. The, the Hinduism is not Hinduism is not going to be dragged on the path trodden by the Taliban. Hinduism is not going to be dragged on the path which has been trodden by the Taliban. Hinduism cannot be dragged. It is too great a religion to be interpreted in a narrow-minded way by people like you for your own interest, Aryaman Sundaram. Anybody who is talking Sundaram. about the entire community, Aryaman Sundaram. The entire community Aryaman Sundaram. has come out of... Arna, what really shocks me, Arna, Arna, what really shocks me is the fact that there can be such vitriolic arguments to justify what is really a very unlawful protest of an attempt to muzzle somebody else. The fact is people keep talking about, yes, there's freedom of speech, but there are also restrictions. 
Don't forget that those restrictions are restrictions which are imposed by law, that's right, that's right. not by other individuals yeah. who don't agree with you. Yeah. Though they are not the ones who have a right to impose the restrictions. Yeah. It's only the law, the state, the courts which can impose those restrictions, in which case the court right. is fully convinced that this is a case where there can be a problem. And let me point out one more thing to you. This whole issue of public order, please understand that the Supreme Court in the same Rangarajan case That's put right. it so beautifully. It can't be an orchestrated threat of violence at all, which can be public disorder. Public disorder cannot be orchestrated. They said it should be like a spark violence to a keg of powder. It must be that immediate reaction, not orchestrated. I am very sorry that we have come to a state today that whether it is an artist who's painting, whether it's an author who's writing, it's whether a person is expressing. If yeah. they don't say exactly what you want them to and say, and I'll tell you who the threat to public a order is. Violent protest, and we try to just. I'll tell you who the threat to public order is. The threat to public order is not the person writing the book. The threat to public order, the threat to public order is the RSS affiliate called the Hindu Munani, which barges into the author's house demanding a copy of the book. They are the threat to public order. Muthalik is the threat to public order, not the author. But why? I'm asking the representative of Hindu Mahasabha. To you, I have something else to, to show you and to tell you. No, Hello. what do you want to show? One sec. Yes, they go ahead. They are not a threat to public order. See, they are not see, the fringe see, also. See. Yogesh Master see, wants to show issue, something very briefly. The issue is this. The issue is this. Wait, 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 that uh, once RSS see. uses Muthalik like people and then they are disowned also. They are disowned also. Because they are only used to, they are laddered to reach to the power which they have attained already. Now these French group groups are only used to meet their political game and their political conspiracy. BJP is trying to make inroad through these kinds Take them of on, Vani. Shobade. 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 Orchestrated moment. Shobade. They fail to understand. Where they fail to understand. When they are talking, the when they're talking the about Hindu religion to or the Sanatan religion, very Excuse well me, permits please the keep politics out of Very this. well permits the neo. No, what you're doing, and what we are fighting against is caste and politics. And it has been the practice I cannot in yell the above you, madam. That was consensual caste politics. as per the statement. We pretend the to be against the caste system, but we support caste politics when it suits us, like it has happened. The threat to public disorder is to be, is to be handled by the state machinery. If at all, the author should have been protected. It's the state's obligation to protect anybody who's threatened by a disorderly mob, Absolutely. which is what has happened in this case. Yeah. It's not, not the do. other way around. State will not the do state was state complicit. The Congo state was complicit in this. The author's life is under threat. The state has to protect him and not those gundas who go to his house and you can't and say create anymore an, uh, and, and, create disorder. and you can't say anymore vani tripathi what the bjp does what the bjp state says all the time vani tripathi vani vani what the bjp always state says is no what is the bjp's argument to all this the bjp's argument to all this is indira one sec just can i just ask one question to vani my question to bjp's problem is right now the only argument of the bjp is please ignore these people Please ignore them. Why should we ignore Very them? Smart move. Why should we smart ignore them? They are they are becoming emboldened. They have their my way no, or the highway approach. Fancy, they use these innocent and so so Wani disown them. Wani when they I know their Wani, you realize now inaction is emboldening emboldening the fringe. You no, can, no. Repeated no, inaction. Do, which no, is why, you know, and what do you do get at the end of it? You don't want Shoka's notice no, on Sakshi Maharaj. Do you think them. anyone's scared about do that? Do not ignore them. Let me let me let me let me just answer that arnab do not ignore them denigrate them the public discourse which is happening through your channel also very much exemplifies it but let me remind you that there should not be a lopsided approach when we talk about free speech we have to be absolutely clear in our democratic processes that anybody whatever fringe whoever fringe and i'm saying it absolutely candidly on your channel absolutely denigrate them but whatever is being no, including the RSS the groups, responsibility of including the, the RSS groups. The no, all. what is the responsibility, the responsibility of the RSS of the to reign in these groups? And, what is the responsibility? And, and before, what is the responsibility before, of the no, RSS to reign before, in the Hindu Munani? Before, 
What is the responsibility of the RSS to rein in the Hindu Munani? What is the responsibility of the RSS is to rein in these groups? Responsibility of everybody. No, no. What is the responsibility of the RSS? The RSS, Rashtriya Swayam Sevak Sangh. The responsibility of everybody. Not everybody. These are RSS groups. Hindu Munani, Vishwa Hindu Panishad. RSS groups. What is the RSS's responsibility? Let me speak. Let me. What is the RSS's responsibility? Are you scared of talking about the RSS's responsibility? What is the RSS's responsibility? Absolutely, I am not scared of talking. What is the RSS's responsibility? Who does vandalism? What is the RSS's responsibility? Freedom of expression. What is the RSS's responsibility? Of literature. Let me. Let me speak. Why do you answer my question? I can let you speak, but answer my question. Why do you answer my question? What is the RSS? Is responsibility. Absolutely, these these groups. These, these groups. Kind of these groups have links to the RSS. Be because our democracy is not about emboldening. Or really, you blame the democracy now? No, won't blame the RSS. And before we start pointing fingers at people, but why don't you? Why don't you even mention the RSS? Before so okay we start point pointing fingers, fingers at the at people, author, we have but to not figure out who these people are. are. We have to figure you're out. You're in defense. You're, you're in. You're in. You're in. You can point I'm fingers at uh, the author, but the not at the people threatening, important. intimidating, scaring him, threatening him with his. Uh, I mean, Some lumpens. Okay? How can you say that his freedom is less than the freedom of those motivated protesters? I think it's time the RSS He's takes no a position I mean, on. So shouldn't someone take responsibility? Your gauge master. If it is, M R Venkatesh saying something. M R Venkatesh. Shouldn't they be penalized? M R Venkatesh. M R Venkatesh. M R Venkatesh. When, when it came to Arna, when it came to Rashdi, the lumpen element settled in the streets. So the lumpen elements will get the was emboldened 20 years back. That we saw to it that the state will not interfere whenever it happens to the uh, to these type of authors or to these type of groups which claim to have been hurt. So the point. No, is no, no. As far as Rashdi is concerned, no, no. As far as Rashdi is concerned, I am quite surprised that you are saying uh, you know not revealing the complete story. But as far as I know, in 1984, Indira Gandhi, then Prime Minister of India, brought a legal action against the novel claiming to be defamed by a single sentence in the penultimate chapter of exactly, a wedding. So, and so and the by the way, no, no. And and. And the no, case was eventually no, no, no. settled out of court with Rashti agreeing to remove the offending sentence. Don't you know that? So, 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 no, so, so what are you saying? Somebody protested and the state. No, no, we are. So I am clear on this. Whether it is Inayatullah or these guys, all it. are the same. I am clear that the state acted as a lumpen element, what? and that is why. So, it what is the is state done. acting why as now? Why should it interfere in artistic freedom? So, what is the state now, acting as now? Why should it interfere in Mr. Rajdi's writing? Right. Fine. What is the state acting like now, Mr. Inayatullah? Yes, please. One minute left on the debate, Mr. Inayatullah. Yes, please. Mr. Arnab. Yes. Please, Mr. Arnab. Let yeah. me. Yeah. Please. Yeah, let me talk. Now you, you, are, you are misconceived. You are you are comparing me with other group and you see it it's is the same thing, here, sir. This same issue. thing. Jayalalita Tamil said Aru, threat to law and order. What did Jayalalita say on Vishwarupam? She said she used the threat to law and order angle. No, no, it's not so. It is very cheap publicity. It is cheap, a cheap publicity they want to have. No. Who wants to have? No, right. Is it the Hindu Munani wants want to have or you want to have? Yes, very cheap publicity. The Sangh Parivar no, so when, when the Hindu Munani they does it, it's cheap publicity. When you do it, it's honorable. In Tamil Nadu, they want to take advantage of this. It doesn't make sense to me. Doesn't make sense to me. Doesn't make sense to me. Mr. Inayatullah. No, no, one second. Closing religion. comments. No, no, Yogesh no, no, Master wants to say something. I, I, Yogesh I, I, Master. I'm not talking about the religion. Yogesh Master. No, you know. Religion. Yes, Yogesh religion. Master wanted uh, to show no, something. No, Yogesh Master. Excuse me. Yes, yes, certainly. We are talking about Perumal Murugan, who has a fictitious story, novel. And uh, these people are provoked and uh, fighting against it on the streets. Here, I want to tell you very clearly, when Mr. Perumal has written something, he has projected certain things from his viewpoint yeah. and it is not very, it is not intentional to do something harm to the society or uh, political, he doesn't have any political thing. Here I have a book to show you, I want to know the answer for the people, those who are talking for uh, uh, Hindutva or uh, okay, go ahead. whatever RSS. Um, okay, here, one minute, I have been extending this. Gandhi was... Uh, Indira, let him, let him show Gandhi the was Dharma Drohi. Gandhi was Dharma Drohi and Desha Drohi, the Supreme Judgment. It is written by Dr. K. V. Sita Ramaya here. And uh, this book is dedicated to uh, Nathuram uh, Vinayak Godse. Yeah. And uh, here, 
he really talking about then rama came into the form of nathuram godse ended the life of gandhi in a broad daylight rama killed ravana krishna killed kamsa godse killed gandhi this is what he is talking about yeah and entire book is to it is not fictional he is he has written intentionally to sow the hatred against gandhi sure. to whom we call father of nation sure. and really i want to ask this what about this kind of books no no, no absolutely monica well, monica arora should file a case very, against this book if going by monica arora's logic she should uh, file a she, case she, against this book but she selective you see she only represents the hindu fringe yes please one last no one second arvind ji let me let me say no no one last word and that say. that goes to kanan sundaram he is the affected party or kanan sundaram kanan sundaram wanted must to say something yeah last word to him he is the affected party kanan sundaram kanan sundaram kanan sundaram kanan sundaram i just i just want to say it i i just want to say it, that parmal murgan is a very responsible writer he is not out to provoke or defame anybody he is somebody who loves his soil write? so much that he is ready that to put down important. his gun and no, leave his hometown not. it's not he is not capable of offending any kongu woman ma man or hindu religion or temple all right and monica arora people should read the novel a novel of okay. a nuanced text and they should try to understand right, right. Me, closing we need not be ashamed of our past C closing this and monica we can, we can monica the more and the, take what is good and you know the, the other side to the story is the more this fringe acts the more it reveals it so i'm telling you somewhere if you fringe this if you feel this fringe has gone on too far if you feel it is time to really take them on take them on hard expose them question them expose their hypocrisy their double standards then then you can speak out against them death of an author is the hash tag tonight it is time to take on these fringe groups because they are nothing but cowards shobha de look at the dignity of the man he leaves he leaves when he says that it the book is not as important to me as interrupting the daily life of the people i mean look at the pain in in that sentence this is what we have reduced one of our great writers great thinkers philosophers authors and scholars to yeah. it's a shame it's a shame on and it is it is the, it is time for more and more people it is, God, it is time for more we defending him life. including you monica it is time for more and more people to come out and speak against this and not and presume and not presume that by speaking out against this you will be in a situation where you could compromise yourself you won't but if you don't speak you certainly will compromise yourself and your own society thank you for joining me on this very interesting chat on the news hour tonight